Hey guys, Joshua Peterson, Peterson Electric. It is mid-May 2023. For my SEO guy is going to be the question of can a space heater, 1500 watt, 12 and a half amps, melt my circuits in a bedroom or living room? Um, yes, they can. Uh, we had to cut new fresh wire up because this was melted to here down into this light up here and then over to here and down and it started to be more fresh wire right here not melted okay that circuit traveled through to this bathroom up to this fan and then uh, actually into this bedroom okay I had to run a brand new circuit right behind here through this closet here And this is the attic space I had to come through with the FMC to get behind here. To get over to here. Sorry, I don't have a camera guy today. Right in there. And I put a quadplex and I did a 12-3 home run because I have a 12, part of that 12-3 is a dedicated circuit. The other one's refixing the other part of this circuit. These wires melted. Here, here, here. These are all these splices. Here, and here. All of that melted through the years from splicing. Show you an overview of this house. That attic space and this attic space do not meet up. That's exactly why I had to use that FMC through that attic. Because that attic hole is right up here. And that wire had melted all the way up through there too and bubbling six times in the panel. We had to run a new piece of FMC up to run that 12-3 wire in here. We are changing out this panel, but these Slim Jim GEs, I've had issues with them. They are you well listed, but we're changing that panel out. And while I'm on that notion, they have a hundred amps, 120, 100 amp service. And you wanna know, 125, sorry, if they can go to 150 once I change the service and I'll do a video on it next month. Yes, the city allowed it, I had to call the engineer department and ask him this has to be a bypass lever and that has to be a new f or, or a new siemens panel that's an fpe with a ge panel the ge panel already had someone mess with the bus bar and wreck it but in a nutshell do you want to have an fpe panel a disconnect no even if you have a panel that's a square DQO in a 1970s home and it's in good shape, you still got to get ready for your FPE disconnect, which is just a single handle on that one. So anyways, guys, again, space heaters run 1500 watts at 12 and a half amps of consistent power. Slim Jim GEs have a hard time sensing that. And evidently, uh, it melted. And so I've had this with air conditioning units as well. So you got to keep that in mind, guys. But yeah, see down here, we couldn't even get down there either. All the way up, that wire back here had to be cut off, fed in through these closets to there. Then I could back feed it. Once I did, it still tripped the breaker. So I had to use my continuity meter, and I knew between black and white, I should never have continuity like you would a baseboard heater. Basically, that wire became one continuous wire all the way through here. They did get new windows, which does help you out, guys, if you, and new doors, so you stop leaking all that, that hot air that you're trying to blow with your furnace. All right, guys, thanks for joining us. Hopefully, it'll help you out, and take care.